like that, and welcome back to Stoneblock. How's everyone doing today? I hope you're all doing good. I am okay, I guess. I'm just trying to figure out a refined storage. So we're going to do some trial and error on camera, and everyone's going to laugh at me and call me a noob. But I'm used to it. <laughs> so let's just get on with it today, shall we? So. Uh, last time we ran through the quests and we made some storage cells and these controllers and these desk drives and everything. Uh, I roughly have an idea of what I'm doing, but not really. So uh, I basically set up the power so it can come through. I just need to do the output so we can get some power in here, the nice green glow of radiation. Uh, so, uh, if I remember rightly, we've got to put the controller down, which gives it some nice big power block system. Uh, and then all we've got to do is what? Put that next to it, and oops, nope, that that would work, but I want it more up there. And then we have access to to this. Uh, but I think what I'm going to actually do is swap that over to that side, and then we can put them in. To there so they've got a nice thing and this tells me that it's got everything connected so good very good uh, I don't think this is going to take too much my power up although it's a continuous drain but what in my system isn't uh, so what I'm going to attempt to do now is connect a few of my storage drawers together because I'd like to be able to access this little lot and that little lot in that system. Uh, I've never really attempted doing anything like this before so yeah this will be interesting. I think I know what I'm doing but like, like I said at the start feel free to put in the comment section you're a noob trying this you don't belong on YouTube. Um, so yeah I think I need these exporters and these normal cables here so that's what we're going to attempt to use and make a complete and utter fool of myself but like I say I'm used to it so we're going to make a few of these guys quite a few of them uh, then we're going to try and make these exporters as well so we need these basic controllers and we're back to doing this again. So, uh, yeah, okay. So, what? Which ones did I need? I needed the uh, construction core, which is and that's iron. I don't think I've got any iron in here, have I? Oh, I have. Good. Haha. <laughs> uh, so we need two of you guys and cook them up. Okay. Um, and I also need uh, the gold variants as well. I've got some more of this processing stuff in here. Good. Uh, oh, uh, was that redstone? Oh, it was. Good. <laughs> I've got some more redstone on me. Okay, so we've got. I've got them. Okay, cool. So I now need to uh, turn that into a construction core, which is some glowstone. Uh, glowstone. I'm just going to turn these two into that. And then hopefully make two of you. Okay. All the achievements today. All the achievements. So I'm going to try with this one first. I think I can just attach that to there, and then we'll dig through back here somewhere. Shouldn't be too much further. There we are. How's that for a guess? Okay, so uh, this is where I should have actually put all my power cables somewhere else, of course. 
set up for now just so I've got power and testing out and everything uh, I'm just gonna do do this nope that's the wrong cable but thanks for trying okay so if I uh, did this it's probably a wireless way to do this as well but at the moment this will do me so uh, does that allow me access to to that uh, that would be a big no okay I didn't think it'd be that easy why would it be um, external storage okay um, constructor destructor reader writer uh, does it need to be an importer instead of an exporter? Because I, I just thought exporter because exporter would, you know, export from that storage drawer into my system. But um, that is obviously the wrong thing to have there. Um, So, should we try the importer and do do that? Because it could be a re reader as well. I guess there's only one way to find that, and that is just to make them. And we will see. Uh, so we'll try the importer. So with this time, we need a destruction core and some basic catalysts. Okay, so yeah, I think we've got everything that we need here. So we need uh, another iron one. I'm only going to make one this time because I know I've got the resources to spare, but still. But, um, yeah, you need to go there, don't you? And then you can get cooked up. Okay, so this time I need quartz. To turn that into a destruction one, uh, then we can do that. Okay, these things tell me anything. Get items of course out of the storage network with an exporter. Get items of course into the storage network with an importer. Hmm. Okay. Um, so first we'll try this way I've got a couple of ideas of how this may work I don't know I honestly don't know so let's just try this oh, the endermen are here anything oh actually yes okay uh, but do these oh it fills up the see I didn't want it to do that I did not want it to do that at all. All I wanted to, to do was actually just recognize what was in there. Is there no way of it doing that? Okay, uh, so let's not have it do that. I don't want it to do that at all. Um, so I thought there would have been a way for it to read or whatever this for that system uh, so maybe we will try this reader okay uh, before I do that let me just empty this out because I don't want them actually in there as such and run, 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 run. Put everything. Oh. Back in there. Hey, why aren't you going back in? Are you actually full? My god, I think it is actually full. 
Oh, fun. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's going to clog the system up. Never mind. Uh, we will. Another problem for another day, I guess. See, I don't even know if what I want to do is actually possible, but we'll, we'll get there. So this time we're trying to make an advanced one. Okay, so we need to we're gonna do a reader this time. Okay, so we need a, a diamond. Uh, get you cooked up. Uh, deconstruction, which is an iron one. you in there thank you and then we need to turn this into a destruction reader destruction code yeah I'm just making sure I'm making the right thing uh, which I'm probably not but still you know what I mean so let's do that one reader uh, we need some more Quartz. Um, where's it gone? <laughs> hey, it's, it's disappeared on me again. There it is. Uh, what else am I missing? Uh, yeah. Uh, reader. Some redstone, redstone, redstone. No redstone. Of course not. Get nice. that. Okay, one reader, there you go. So, will this now just read everything that's in that system and allow me to use it? Oh, is what I'm saying not possible? Um. Not nothing there is there. Uh, no. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, no. <sighs> A detector. Is it the external storage one that I need? <laughs> Isn't this fun? Uh, see, I really wish mods would come with books. I really do. But, um, one K storage block. I need to try and make something like this fit to import into. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try making this uh, external storage. It, it, it could be. I honestly don't know. Uh, I can hear everyone typing in the comments. Already, so yeah, we just need two chests. Uh, destruction cores, <laughs> all the fun and game bits again. So let's have a look. External storage. So we need a construction core, a destruction. So we need two iron, and one gold. So. Two iron, one gold, and they can go in there. We need um, one bit of quartz, one bit of glowstone. Uh, da, 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 da. So one with glowstone construction core. Uh, one um, with quartz and 
then didn't I thought I made one with gold? Oh, did I make one? I could have sworn I made one with gold. I'd have to have a look at the video on that. That's oh, it is there. Okay, must have been another one that I had on me. Uh, that's fine. Anyway, we'll cook that up because I've got no other need for it. So we just need some chests. Okay, a couple of chests and external storage. Storing externally. Using external storage to provide the network with storage from external blocks like a chest. Aha! 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 Yes, Mr. Enderman. Aha! Uh, now we want to go in this one first, don't we? So it's do that sounds more like what I'm after. Does that work? No. Oh, oh, hello. Um, display craftable display number. Yes, it's all there. Yay for the win. Oh, okay. Um, awesome. So we've got all that little lot there, which is nice. So I can just type in iron or my irons there. Yeah, awesome. Cool. Um, yes, thank you. Yeah, okay, but we'll, we'll keep hold of them. We might as well just stick them in there for now. <laughs> uh, and then we can tr make another one of them for the other bits. That sounded professional, didn't it? For the other bits. Uh, for this one. Okay, so it's another one of these. Okay, no problem. We are getting there. Yay, we're actually getting somewhere. That's what I wanted. I know there'd be something like it. Okay, so uh, that one, that one. We need some gold. We need some more iron, which we've got on us. Thank you. So you can go in there, cook you up, you don't actually need the other gold because we've already got it thankfully, uh, then we turn you into you, uh, you into you, awesome, uh, then we need two more chests, and that's that, and an external storage, yay. Oh, might actually be getting somewhere, I don't know where, but we're actually getting somewhere now. <coughs> Unfortunately, what I'm gonna have to do is break this so I can actually have that on this side. Uh, so I'm not messing around too much with cables and such. Uh, so let's make sure the speed upgrades go in there and the filter and I'm going to need another watch me call it cable but uh, we can sort this out we can sort this out and then hopefully I can just connect you to there we will munch on some epic bacon. Because I deserve the epicness. And we shall see. Yay! Hey, the thing's in there as well. Awesome. Oh, that was a lot of work. Uh, but now I know how to do it. Cool. Uh, we're okay for power, we're fine for power. We are fantastic for power. Right, so, uh, now I need to look at how to maybe do things a little bit more wirelessly, uh, so I can connect this up, uh, maybe a few of these, I don't know. Uh, 
definitely these guys and definitely the mob farm so is there a wireless version of that see I've only just figured out how to do it with wires is there any way to do it wirelessly I know there's a wireless thing here that I can try and make in the future um, and I'm not as long as I can make enough wires which should be easy enough in this pack I can do it all oh a wireless transmitter must be placed on a cable okay so I need to what make these uh, chest external storage things put a cable on that then put a wireless transmitter on that does that make sense and machine casing okay so yeah definitely gonna need a lot more stuff like that so yeah that it could be that hmm. I'm gonna have to mess around with that over the weekend but I think uh, yeah, even though this is probably very simple for you and you probably already knew this uh, this is a win for me because I did not know how to do this uh, so it was a bit of a trial and error and I'm looking for my transfer pipes there we are uh, so yeah because I don't really do a right lot with these sort of storage systems or anything like that mainly because I've never really got that far and I can work out of chests and be a noob like that uh, but why did I get a lot of prosperity shards? Huh, never mind. Uh, but yeah, I can put a few things in here now. I'm going to probably have to make a few more of these anyway for bits like that. But uh, yeah, and that's that's going to work. So yeah, I'm going to end it here on my little victory. I know it might not be seen one to you, but it is a victory for me because uh, I am kind of trying to learn this. I'm going to try and tidy up some of these wires and everything as well uh, and we'll see what happens so yeah, thank you very much for joining me. If you did enjoy today's episode please remember to hit that like button and if you've got any hints, tips suggestions or complaints, feel free to put that down in the comment section below and uh, I will see you next Tuesday thank you very much and I'll see you next time Bye <laughs>